It is a gym unlike any other, but its mission goes beyond getting in shape. A small fitness center in Seguin aiming to provide a supportive and inclusive environment for people with amputations. It is an idea spawned by the owner's personal journey. Our Jonathan Cotto has that story. You were given a gift, and you could say an amputation is a gift, or you know, you might not, but to me, for me personally, I think it was a gift. 24-year-old Jaden Dennis lost his hand in a work accident in 2015. What happened was uh, I was picking up a pipe into this machine and uh, it caught the edge of my glove. Dennis's dream was to serve in the military, but the mishap changed the course of his future. After spending weeks in the hospital, Dennis discovered a new passion in fitness thanks to his involvement in ROTC. So I led all of the physical training, all of the workout regimens, uh, took us to competitions and stuff like that. He says he did go through an emotional roller coaster, but didn't let his amputation limit his dreams. I started competing in powerlifting, won my first competition, told myself this is what I want to do. I love this. This is like me. And his ambitions didn't end there. And then um, when I won the first competition, I decided I want to open a gym. Dennis, now a certified personal trainer, opening Flex Abled. You know, whether it's for able-bodied people or disabled people, I just want to help push people to be the best they want it to be. Flexabled will offer a variety of workouts curated by Jaden. He says this gym was created in an effort of creating a space that's welcoming and empowering for amputees where they can thrive and accomplish their goals. For more information, you can visit our website, KSET.com. Reporting Jonathan Cotto, KSET 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.